Michelle, tell me what you think about your Holland Grill. I think it's fabulous. We use it seven days a week, 365 days a year, and there's not much we haven't cooked on it. We've cooked everything from pies to baked potatoes to hobo dinners. All right, we're here with Paul from uh, Elgin, Texas. He's a, a satisfied Holland Grill. Paul, what do you think about your Holland uh, Grill? It's just the greatest grill that's ever made on that, on uh, any kind of cooking you want to do, for sure. We do a lot of outside, at least four or five times a week in Texas, since the weather can be cold or raining or whatever. It cooks good, even heat. You never have a problem with it at all. How long have you had your grill? Probably about six years now. Six years. Hey, we're here with Jeff here in Minneapolis, Minnesota. Jeff, what do you think about your Holland Grill? Honestly, I think it's the easiest grill on the market today to grill with. The uh, food comes off juicy with little or no burned products. It's absolutely unbelievable. Great. Well, we're here with Larry in Great Tennessee at uh, over in East Tennessee. Uh, Larry, what do you think about your Holland Grill? Well, it's, it's, it's just amazing. I've had mine for a year and was lucky enough to get it for Father's Day, and I use it about three or four times a week, and it's, it's made me the hero at the house. I uh, fire it up, put on the meat, leave it alone. It makes you, it makes you the, the top chef, I it? am the hero of the house, and it's just no cleanup to it, man. You just put it on, and then you come back and take it off, and it's ready. Great. Thanks, Great. Larry. Appreciate, Appreciate it. Appreciate you. Yeah. Okay, we're here with uh, Nadine and her sister, Isabel, yes. in Tennessee. And uh, tell me, what do you think of your Holland Grill? It is the best grill I have ever cooked with in my life. I love the ease of it. I can just put my food on. I put my timer on, come back, flip it over. It's wonderful. works really great. And I'm just thrilled that you've come out with uh, some new products. And I see that you've got a new electric over there that I'm really interested in as well. So we're, we're just thrilled to death. Thank well, there you go. Thank yeah. you. Thank you very much. Well, we're here with Buddy in uh, Litchfield, Kentucky. Uh, uh, Buddy, tell me what's been so good about the Holland Grill for you guys. Well, Scott, if you have me talking about what's good about the Holland Grill, you better have lots of tape in that camera. I, I'm, I'm not up on digital things how long they'll go. But uh, we've probably been selling uh, the Holland Grill for 10, 15 years at least. And, uh, before, and before even trying to sell them, I used to see, uh, see them demoed at the uh, Southeast Trade Show in Atlanta. And I thought there's no way that we can sell a grill that expensive in our location. I just didn't think they would sell. And uh, more or less on a dare, I, uh, I decided to sell a few of them. And I have found the reason why they sell is because they're so easy to use and food tastes great. All right, we're here at the uh, 2008 Hearth and Home Show in Atlanta, Georgia. And Don, the Donald Jones, is going to show you what we've got cooking on that Holland Grill. Don, what do we got on there? All right, just come a little closer. Let me show you what we got here. We got the only grill on the market that's guaranteed not to flare up. We got a 19-pound turkey. Ooh, it takes about three hours, three hours and fifteen minutes to cook. All you do is just put it on the grill, season it real good, leave it right there, shut the lid. And don't open it up for three hours, three hours and 15 minutes. And when you do open it up, it's golden brown. It's awesome. Every time. The Holland Grill. You can't beat it. He's going to try the pork here. A little bit of the Boston Bud here. Chef Bird's going to serve up a good, healthy portion of uh, Boston Bud. Good thing. HP, right, a little barbecue sauce. We have to the barbecue sauce. This young man's going to tell us his honest opinion of what he thinks of this food. See ya. Oh, there he goes. He's going to take it. That's a good sign. Excellent. Good. Great. Thank you. Chef Birds found another. Uh, is that good? That rocks. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Meatloaf's going there. Those, oh yeah, that's wonderful. That's all right. Holland Grill, Ohio all right. meatloaf. I think chicken tacos. Is that right? Tacos. Just cook the chicken, then you'll. Chicken is seasoned, and then on the side burner, we've got some onions that were sautéed oh, and olive man. oil that with tomatoes wonderful. and green chilies. That looks wonderful. And then get the, get the sausage and biscuits going there too. Can't beat that on all. They are cooking everything for their dealers to sample today and eat. So I can show this great food you're cooking on there. Right. What are those? What they, obviously a kebab of some kind. Hungarian sausage kebab. Hungarian sausage kebab. 
Those look just wonderful. Got a whole plate of them. It looks like we got a, I'm guessing that's a fruit pizza over there. Wow. Never had one of those? Not off the Holland Grill. That looks just wonderful. Look at that thing. All the blackberries. Over here is uh, grilling a lot of onions and green peppers, it looks like. Or, I guess, the world-famous omelets for two. Well, what all's in that? Cheese, obviously, eggs. Cheese, ham, ham, mushrooms. The cheese, ham, and mushrooms. That looks great. Yeah. Simply made, excellent to taste. Roll They're them up, awesome. put them on the grill. How long have they cooked? 18 minutes. 18 minutes. Yeah. Don't need to turn them, or you roll, roll them around oh, a little bit? you might need to turn them a little bit. Just roll them a little? Pretty much, they're going to pretty much even this cook. Wait, yeah. wait till those are done. See how it turns out. All right, Dave here is cooking venison. Yeah, yes, that looks wonderful. Oh. They look like they're doing pretty good. They look great. I'm cooking it without the uh, without the turkey on the grill. There it is, yeah. golden brown. Well, uh, Celery, onions, breadcrumbs. Becky's sampling some of the food there that we got. Got the kebabs, pizza, and the meatloaf. I told her just to get a little piece, but I guess she was hungry. <laughs> Yes, I, it, it, I have tried it. It's really good. Buckeye meatloaf, by the way. It's important what I'm trying to see. But they don't want to raise the lid yet, that prime rib on the Holland. I'm going to get Bob to open that up one time and let me look at it. Rib ready. They're, they're not even letting, forming a the line. They're just jumping right on him. Oh, that looks great. Prime rib on the Holland Grill. They've got about uh, 25 workers. Let me look at it one more time. Italian grilled cheese sandwiches. Is that what they're making? Oh, man, those look great. Whew. Tom, oh, man, those look good. Baby backs. Oh, there we go. Well, we got, uh, was it cherry and peach? Cherry and blueberry. A cherry and blueberry. Oh, wow. Like 55 minutes. Those look wonderful. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Those look good. Lamb chops. Lamb chops. On um, and what did you season those with? Greek. The Greek. Yeah, you figure if you go with lamb, you might as well go with Greek. Might as well. Perfect. They look great. Oh, they look about another uh, 11 degrees. We're going to find out. Good.